Look, they bounce. <laughs> so for this tutorial today, I curled my hair with the Soul Trip Bombshell. I believe it's the one inch curling rod. Um, and this is how I did it. And now I have a Dutch braid in the front going back. And this is how it looks in the back and on the sides. And I'll show you guys how I did that today. So for this hair tutorial, first thing you're going to do is comb your hair and get rid of any knots or tangles. Um, excuse my disturbed face, but you will spray a heat protectant to protect your hair from the heat of the curling iron. And you will comb one more time just to make sure the heat protectant applies evenly. So you're going to part your hair in however many parts you're comfortable with, however you feel that you can manage your hair better. For me, just a couple partings are okay. And I'm going to start curling my hair in the bottom. The thing I really like about the bombshell is that you can curl your hair in thick sections. Well, not thick sections, but you can curl a decent amount of hair. Whereas with other curling irons, you have to work with small strands. So what you're going to do is roll it around the barrel and just hold it for a few seconds for from about 5 to 8 seconds should be good and then you'll catch it right in your hand hold it for a couple seconds allow it to cool and then let it hang loose um, this curling iron if you are using this one it comes with a glove so that you don't burn yourself it's a really good idea because it burns so again you'll curl it around the iron hold it for a few seconds and then you're going to catch it once more in your hand and allow it to cool and again you just let it go so you're just going to repeat this process throughout the rest of your head I didn't film how I curled my whole head because this video would be super long so I'm just going to let you watch for a few more seconds and then I'm going to cut the tape and record off camera So as you can see, I already curled the rest of my head. I'm just going to finish off these last few strands at the top of my head. Sorry that you can't see what I'm doing. I didn't notice my camera was lower. But it's pretty much the same idea, the same technique. You're going to roll it around the barrel, hold it for a few seconds, and let it go. So now that I'm completely done curling, I'm going to comb through my hair with my fingers just to mess up the curls a little bit and give them that nicer look that I personally like. So I'm going to now curl my bangs because I don't like how my bangs look curled. So I'm just going to braid them. I'm not sure if I said I'm going to curl or I'm going to braid them. But I'm going to braid them. So I'm going to Dutch braid them and I'm not going to go great into detail with the Dutch braid because I do want to make a tutorial all about braiding so just try to figure out how to do it just from watching if you don't already know how and follow the rest of my tutorials if you want to learn how to do it. So 
So now that we're done braiding, all we're going to do is pin it wherever we want to with a bobby pin. And we're just going to finish up any final touches like re recurl any curls that might have gotten messed up throughout the process like these here. So that's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to finish up the final touches. So thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoy it. Bye. Thank you.